Hello, 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 everybody. All right, now I'm gonna show you guys how to find the end behavior of a linear function. All right, looking at this graph, just like I said in the previous video, we wanna look at it in two different parts, the left side and the right side. All right, looking at the left side of the graph, if you look at the x-axis on the left side, these numbers right here, they're always gonna be negative numbers. They're gonna keep going and going and going all the way to negative infinity. So this first statement that says, as x approaches blank, I'm gonna say my x is gonna be approaching negative infinity because this is gonna represent the left side and this will be the right side. And then if you look at the right side of the graph on the x-axis, these numbers right here are always gonna be positive and they're gonna keep going to positive infinity. So in that second statement, my x is gonna approach positive infinity. Now, looking at the actual line of this graph, on the left side, if you see, it's going up. So therefore, it's going all the way up to positive infinity. So in that first statement where I said as x approaches negative infinity, my y approaches positive infinity. Now looking at the right side of the graph, the line is going down. So that means it's going to negative infinity. So in the second statement where I said as x approaches positive infinity, my y approaches negative infinity. And that's it.